Hi, and welcome to this section of the Basic Math Word Problem Tutor, where we're going to continue working with fractions. But in this section, we're going to deal with uh, fractions, uh, dividing fractions, okay, and the word problems here. So the good news is, and it's very good news, is that if you go back to the uh, section on multiplication of fractions, uh, and the word problems there, and if you can do that, which I, I think by now you can, then this section is going to be very easy, okay? Because just like anything else in life, if you learn the basics and start building on it, then the next topic and the next topic and the next topic come that much easier, okay? <clears throat> so just think about it. Once you know how to add two numbers together, uh, subtraction isn't that big of a deal. It's the opposite of addition. Same thing with, uh, with this here. When you know how to multiply fractions, I'm going to show you here that division of fractions ends up being multiplication. So I'm going to show you how to divide fractions uh, and using the skills that we gain by reading the word problems. But in the actual math itself, I'm also going to show you that division of fractions is nothing more than multiplication. I'm going to show you that. It's going to be very easy. And you're just going to end up doing a lot of multiplying here, even though it's actually division. And that's the title of this section. So the easiest way to do it is just to jump right on in like we always do. Question is, you have one half of a pie on the table. If you split the pie, or the half of a pie that's there, between two people, how much pie does each person get? Okay, so that's the question. So what you're doing here is you have half of a pie on the table, okay, you have this much pie, and you're splitting it, which means you're dividing it by two, right? Because there's two people, you're splitting it, uh, and you're dividing it by two between two people, and you want to see how many, pe how much each person actually gets, okay? So this is clearly division, because you're given some piece, and you're splitting it between some number of people, so you're dividing it into an equal number of pieces, okay? So don't let the fact that this has a fraction in it confuse you. Just because there's half a pie on the table doesn't change the fact that you're taking that, and you're splitting it between two people. So what you're doing is you're taking that one half of a pie, and dividing it by two. And so that's what we're going to do, and we're going to write it down exactly like this. You have one half of a pie, okay, and you are dividing it by two, okay? So notice what I'm doing here. I've got my one half up here, and I've got a very long division bar, which, by the way, fraction is the same as division, so I've just got a big long division bar, dividing it by two, okay? So that's what I like to do here. I like to write it like this. You can also see this a lot of times. You'll see this on your test, you know, divided by two. You'll see it like this, okay? One half divided by two. You'll see it like this a lot. But this is exactly the same thing, and I want you to learn how to look at it that way. It'll make your life easy, okay? You're taking this number, and you're dividing it by two. Okay, now the question is, how do you go from here? What do you do next? Well, in order to divide fractions, just like, uh, just like in the adding and subtracting and the multiplying of the fractions, I said let's take every number and let's make it into a fraction before we actually do any addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. Here we have a 2 on the bottom, and we're dividing by 2. Okay, So this 2, I want to make it into a fraction because then it's going to be easy. So I'm going to have 1 half divided by 2 over 1. Okay, That's what I'm doing, 1 half divided by 2 over 1. Okay, because 2 over 1 is equal to 2. Okay? So, now here is, here is the magic. Here is the beauty. Here is why it's easy. Okay, I'm going to show you something. Anytime you have a fraction divided by another fraction, all you do is take this fraction, flip it over, and multiply it by the top. And that's why division becomes multiplication when you're talking about fractions. So what you would do is you would take your 1 half and you would multiply it by 1 half because this 2 over 1 